She was born to Anne Noel and Walter Nixon in New York City. Her mother was an actress while her father was a radio journalist. She went to Hunter College High School before joining Barnard College. She studied with Semester at Sea in 1986. She first appeared as an imposter on the television game show, To Tell the Truth, where her mother worked. Her first acting role was at the age of 12 in the ABC after-school special, The Seven Wishes of a Rich Kid, in 1979. In 1980 she made her film debut in Little Darlings in which she played the role of Sunshine. The film also had other teen actresses like Christy McNichol and Tatum O'Neill. She appeared in two of Mike Nichols' hit Broadway plays in 1984 while she was still a college student. The plays were The Real Thing and Hurly Burly. After playing small roles in film she landed in a major supporting role in the movie, The Manhattan Project, in 1986 in which she helps her boyfriend in building a nuclear bomb. In 1988, she appeared in the two-part TV miniseries, The Murder of Mary Fagan, which is the story of a factory worker who is accused of murdering a 13-year-old girl. She played Donna in the 1991 miniseries, Love, Lies, and Murder which was based on the murder of Linda Bailey Brown. The series was aired in two parts. Who is Cynthia Nixon? Most acclaimed for playing Miranda Hobbs, the career-minded and cynical lawyer in the HBO series, Sex and the City, actress Cynthia Nixon is a famous theater, television and film actress. Following the success of the HBO series, movies based on the concept followed in which she reprised her role of Miranda. Lanky, slim and with short blonde hair, Cynthia may not be a beauty in the traditional sense, but then it is her unconventional looks that lends itself perfectly to make her the great character actress that she is. Born to an actress and radio journalist, it is no surprise that she herself decided to enter the show business. Known for her tremendous confidence, which she inherited from her parents, she is someone who believes in following her heart come what may. She began acting along with her mother when she was just 12. Being the daughter of an actress made it easier for her to acquire roles initially but it was her pure talent and hard work that paved the way for further success. She began appearing in movies, television and theatrical productions as a teenager. Diagnosed with cancer at the prime of her career, she bravely fought the disease to emerge a winner.